So PRP stands for platelet-rich plasma, and that is a product that we make from your blood. And so what we do is take some of your blood with just a needle into your vein as if you were given a blood draw to donate blood or get a blood test done. And we take about 15 milliliters of that blood and we stick it into a special syringe that we can put into a centrifuge. And in that centrifuge, the centrifuge spins and that layers out the blood based upon the molecular weight or the contents of that blood. We can take the blood, we can spin it in the centrifuge and all the red blood cells push to the bottom. And there's a layer called the buffy coat that's kind of in between the red blood cells and then a top layer that is the plasma layer. And then we can take that top layer, which has plasma as well as platelets in it, and it's a platelet-rich plasma. And that's the product that we use. Arthritis, and that word just means joint inflammation. And typically what we have is degenerative arthritis. And what that means is that there's changes in the cartilage and the meniscus that then signal to the joint that it should be inflamed. And it's like a warning signal to your body. So with inflammation, there are ways to decrease inflammation. Some of those are things that we take by mouth, such as ibuprofen or, or Aleve. Other things we can inject into your knee to also help control that inflammation cycle, one of them being platelet-rich plasma. And platelet-rich plasma has been developed around knee arthritis, and they did preclinical animal studies, meaning they did studies in animals to see if, if growth factor therapies would work or help. They also did PRP studies with animals, and they did studies in humans, starting with just clinical trials or clinical series, and then going to randomized control trials. And that whole body of evidence now is pretty much a pyramid of evidence, with the base being the animal studies, the next layer being the early human trials, and the following layers as we learn more and more. To the point now I can say there's a pyramid of evidence that supports platelet-rich plasma for knee arthritis. And what it does is help control the inflammation of the problem because your body is understanding the changes of cartilage and meniscus inside and helping you as a system or an ecosystem adapt to that and change. And so platelet-rich plasma we use to leverage your own immune system to help you through this degenerative process.